guys! So today I'm super excited to share with you this really awesome DIY beauty tutorial. So let me give you a little bit of a background story. I actually wrote a blog about artichoke tea like back in 2007 or 2008 and I just raved about artichoke tea and actually before I even learned about washing my face, skincare or anything like that, my mom used to make me drink a ton of artichoke tea so that I don't break out and it actually helped me quite a bit. And the reason why I take so much care and thought into making artichoke tea is because I kind of got it down to a science. So before we even do any of the DIY stuff, I kind of want to give you a little bit of a background story on artichoke and how it actually can help your skin. So we're going to do just a little, little bit of science. So most of you might not be familiar with artichoke or the origins of them. All you really need to know is that an artichoke is a thistle. The part that we usually see at the store is actually the flower of the plant. Now when you want to get rid of acne, you have to figure out why you get them. Is it stress, hormones, or your nasty diet? Some say that the liver can actually be a result of having bad acne. Now our body creates and absorbs toxins every single day. And the liver helps rid of these toxins, break down fats, and most importantly, it can turn one hormone into a different hormone. Now any effect in any of these three categories can cause stress to the body and actually trigger acne. Now artichoke tea is known to keep a happy and healthy liver. It also helps the liver excel in getting rid of toxins from the body. So let's dip into the amazing DIY. I bought my artichoke from a local grocery store in the produce aisle. Now you'll want to cut your artichoke into quarters. This way the artichoke can really release all of its goodness into the water. Be sure to open up the petals to thoroughly clean the flour. The best artichoke to water ratio is for every 2 gallons of water, you need half an artichoke. Trust me, it's more than enough. By the way, try using distilled water. You don't want any faucet metals in your body. It ruins the whole idea of ridding toxins with artichoke tea. Once it gets to a rolling boil like this, you'll want to turn it down to a low simmering heat. Let it sit there for 25 minutes uncovered. If you go any longer or even cover it, your tea will turn brown and from what my mom has told me, you are overcooking the goodness of the artichoke. And of course, mama always knows best. After 25 minutes, turn off the heat and let it cool. It will have a deep forest green color. Now you have to let it cool down to near room temperature before you put it in the fridge, otherwise it will spoil. So go ahead and pour yourself a nice cool glass every single morning for a refreshing start. Or what I also like to do is take a compressed facial mask, pour some of the artichoke tea onto it, then place the mask on my face for about 15 minutes while I sip on this awesome drink. When you take the mask off, just rub the rest of the tea into your face and apply moisturizer. It will help hydrate the skin as well as brighten your skin. If you are anything like me and you make two batches of artichoke tea almost every other week, you'll waste a lot of artichoke. All I like to do with it is turn them into a nice delicious dip. Just take off the leaf and use a knife to take off the soft part of the artichoke. Keep doing so until you get to the middle. When you get to the heart of the artichoke, it will have this fuzziness on it. Just use your finger to pluck it off. Next, just use your knife to chop up everything up. Then for half a large artichoke, I like to add 2 tablespoons of cream cheese to it. For flavoring, I like to shake on some cilantro to top it off. Trust me, it is super delicious on toast and bagels and make a great light breakfast. Afterwards, however, you do end up using a lot of artichoke leaves. I like to take a pair of scissors and cut out little crescent shapes with them. I focus more on the base of the petal because it's the softest and has the most moisture. Then I place the leaves under my eye to rejuvenate my dark circles and puffy eyes. Now the cool thing is, you can keep a plate of this in the fridge and pop it on every single day for about 15 minutes. It goes bad when the drink goes bad. So isn't artichoke like the coolest thing in the grocery store? Oh, by the way, here's a quick tip. In a week, the drink will turn into a funky color. It's letting you know that it needs to be thrown out and you need to make a new batch. Now if you try to drink this instead of water for two weeks straight, you will see how significantly great your skin will look. But also also keep in mind that artichoke tea will make you go to the bathroom like crazy. It's just your liver getting rid of all that nasty yucky stuff in your body. So I know that was a lot of information and you guys are probably like, whoa, this is crazy, should I even try this out? And you know what, artichoke is only about $1.50 to $2.99 each. So you can go to the supermarket and just pick up one and uh, try it out. So I hope you guys enjoy and um, good luck to all of you who is going back to school. Bye!